just one moment. Welcome one more time to the class, students. I'm really happy to see you here. Today, I'm going to show you something new. I'm going to uh, start opening your classroom presentation tool. Everyone, everybody, open your books and let's work. Let's go. Let's go to something here. Okay, let me see. Let me do this. I'm going to do something. One moment. One moment, students. Aha. There it is. We were working on the unit number 10, right? Yeah. We're talking on the unit number 10, the previous class. That's it. Open, please. The unit number 10. Mm -hmm. We're learning here some words. For example, you know, climb, throw, jump, kick, paint, play, run. Then we have learned about the use of I can, right? Para indicar que yo puedo. I can run, I can draw, I can climb, I can paint, etc. Then we're learning about the number. Do you remember the number song? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, twelve dogs on the farm. Do you remember the song? Yeah, right? And then we, we have learned another song about the numbers. Do you remember the song that says, oh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, jump, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Jump, 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 stop. Spin, 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 stop. Sing one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Jump. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. 20. Jump, 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 stop. Spin, 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 stop. I can count to 20. Oh, that's it. That's the song, right? Do you remember? I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play the song for you. I'm gonna open here the number song, the number, the number, the number one to 20 song, right? This is something that uh, we were learning, we were learning previously. One moment, please, this is it. Number one to 20 song. Okay, one moment, please. Mm. And that's it. I'm gonna stop the recording option. One moment. Very well. That's why I'm so glad for that because you are singing excellent. Now let's see, students. We must go to the next part. What do we have here? Okay, let me see. Let me check. This is something that we have to work on now. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. We did this the previous class, 71. Now it's time to work on this part, the 72. What's this? Here says, lesson five, video and story, activity one, watch and match. Okay, look, here we have uh, oh, some children, some girls and boys, right? Here we have Alia, Kathleen, Marcel Rafi. And look, oh my God. <gasps> These are camels. And look the number, number 30, uh, V7, 7. Oh, 
It's a race, right? Es una carrera. It's a race, race. Look at the camel, my God. Oh, that's very great. That's very great. Now, look, what do we have here? Oh, hiya! Kung Fu, right? Maybe he can kick, right? Kick. And the camels run, run, kick. And look this. It seems to be a sport like swing, right? This is swing. Swing, right? And look. Oh, is this a sport? Yes, right? What sport is it? Is it tennis? Mm -mm. Is it baseball? Mm -mm. It's another sport. You are going to know now what sport is it. So please, you're going to watch the video, then you're going to match. You're going to tell me who talks about this, this race, this camel race. Alia, Caitlin, Marcelo, Rafi. Who talks about Haya, the Kung Fu? Alia, Caitlin, Marcelo, Rafi. You have to match. We have to match. Okay. According to the video. So I'm going to do something here. I'm going to move this on this part. Yeah. Let's start, students. Pay attention. Pencils in the hand because you have to match pencils. Pencils in the hand, pencils, pencils, pencils. Okay. Okay, very good. So let's start. I'm going to do something. I'm Marcel. I'm Caitlin. I'm Ruffy. Hi, Marcel. Tell me about a sport in Brazil. Soccer. I like soccer. Yes, of course. And? And water polo, too. Water polo? Yes, I can play water polo. I can swim, I can jump in the water, I've got the ball and go! Is it fun? Yes, it is. Hi, Alia. Tell me about a sport in the UK. Well, I like soccer a lot. <laughs> yes, yes. And? And cricket too. Cricket? Yes. I can play cricket. I can hit the ball. I can run too. Is it fun? Yes, it is. Hi, Caitlin. Hello. Tell me about a sport in China. Soccer is my favourite. Yes, soccer, soccer. Tell me about another sport. I can do Kung Fu. I can kick and jump. Look, this is a boy doing Kung Fu. Wow, that's cool. Hi, Rafi. Tell me about a sport in Saudi Arabia. I like soccer, of course. No more soccer. I want other sports. OK. Um, I like racing. Car racing? No, no, no. I like camel racing. Camel racing? Yes, camel racing. Look at the camels. One, two, three, four, five camels. They can run. OK, now, students. You are going to tell me here the answers. This is going to be 
open microphone, tell me who talks about the camel racing? Alia, Caitlin, Marcelo, Rafi. Hmm? Who talks about the camel racing? Alia, Caitlin, Marcelo, Rafi. 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 Oh, Rafi. excellent. Rafi. Rafi, right? Rafi talks about the camel racing. And who talks about Kung Fu? Alia, Caitlin, or Marcel? Teacher. Yes. What? Caitlin. Very good. Caitlin. I'm going to do this. Caitlin talks about Kung Fu. Now tell me who talks about water polo? Who talks about water polo? Mm -hmm. Who talks about water polo students? Marcel, excellent. Marcel talks about water polo. So let's do this. And finally, who talks about cricket? Alaya. Mm -hmm. Alaya. Alaya. Alia, right? Alia. Alia talks about cricket. So we have to do something here. I'm going to write. I'm going to throw the line for Alia. Okay, that's it. Alia talks about cricket. Very good. You finish? Finish? Oh, why not? This is page number 39. 39. This is the page. Finish, teacher. Excellent. Yes, very good, Xiomara Perales. Great. Very good, Ian Calet. Finish, finish. Finish, Raul, finish. Okay, very good, Mora Tiago, excellent.
Okay, now students, let's continue. Yeah, very good, Elena Mesa, excellent. Let's go to the next part. We have to go to the next part. What says here? Activity two, read the unit 10 story and circle. Value, be kind to the animals. Do the unit 10 value activity in the workbook. Let's go to this part. Let's go to the story part. Are you here? Are you in the story part? Yes. Vamos, vamos. Let's go to the end of, to the last part of our book. Vamos a la parte final de nuestro book. A ver. Estamos, estamos ahí. Recuerden, vamos a la sección de stories, a la sección de historias de nuestro book. Ok. Yeah, are you in the last part? Yes, very good, Ian Khaled. Who else is in the last part? Let's go to the last part. Very good, Paula Valentina. Mm -hmm. Very good, Adrian. Very good, Elena. Elena. Okay, very good, Elena Mesa. Very good, Xiomara Perales. Very good, Daniela. Very good, Raul. Excellent, Raul. Teacher, Luciana no se llama Raul, se llama Luciana Naomi. Ay, 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 ¿qué hace? ¿Qué hace esa niñita con el nombre de Raul? My God. Ese es mi papá, su nombre. Ya, pero vamos a cambiar. Lo vamos a cambiar, ¿ya? Vamos a decirle ahí a papito, mamita, a ver que nos ayude a cambiar el nombre, ¿ok? Ya, let's start. Es que si no me equivoco, pues yo veo solo acá la lista de nombres y veo ahí el nombre que dice Raúl. Ok, ya, vamos. Mire, vamos, esto está en la parte final de nuestro libro, ¿ya? La verdad, yo no tengo el número, niños, no tengo el número, pero vamos al final de nuestro libro, ahí está, por ahí está Carlos y está llegando, ¿verdad? Buscamos esta imagen, ¿ok? ¿Estás en esta parte? ¿Ya lo encontramos? Yes. Ok, muy bien, Michelle Rodríguez, muy bien, Carlos Matías, excelente. I think we must continue, right? We must continue with this part. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Is everybody on this part? Yes, right? Let's start now. Let's start. I'm going to ask here, students, tell me. What is it? It's a ball or it's a train? A ball. It's a ball or it's a train? Ball. Very ball. good. It's a ball, ball. right? Ball. ball. Okay. What color is the ball? What color is the ball? Black and white. Very good. It's black and white. Excellent. Now, you tell me, what action is this girl doing? What action is it? It's swim or it's kick? What do you think? Kick. Kick. Kick, right? It's kick. kick. It's kick. Yes, the girl kicks the ball. The girl can kick it's the ball, kick. right? Now tell me, how is the girl? The girl is happy or sad? It's happy. Oh, very it's good. Happy. She is happy. happy, right? She is happy. So I have to ask another, another question. Oh, well, let's start with the story. Let's start with the story. 
what's what's gonna say this story let me see let me see i'm gonna do something here i'm gonna do something here and let's do this no here the girl says look my ball is black and white i can kick my ball and look the boy is saying wow right the boy is saying wow because the girl can kick the ball yeah that's so interesting let's continue what happens next on the story oh look what animal is it it's a dog or it's a uh, a chicken oh oh it's a dog right wow wow and now what action is this dog doing this is paint or this is jump it's jump oh very jump. good jump. It's, yeah. it's jump right it's jump the dog the wow wow yeah. jumps right so we have to do something else. And what happened with the girl? What happened with the girl? Look at the girl. The girl is kind of surprising, right? And look, look what says this boy. Look, it's a dog. It can jump. The dog can jump. And now look at the girl. The girl says, hey, it's my ball. And look what happens here. Oh, now tell me, how is the girl? The girl is sad. happy or the girl is sad? Sad. Sad. Oh, sad. The girl oh, is sad. 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 sad, right? Yeah. The girl is sad, my God. That's because of the dog, right? The dog is with the girl's uh, ball. And now, what do you think? What do you think happens next? Hmm? Look, the boy is saying something. I like this dog. It's happy. And the girl says, I'm sad. I want my ball. Quiero mi ball. I want my ball. <gasps> Oh dear, that's too bad, right? Let's see what happens next. Oh, now here is the dog, the boy and the girl. And what says the boy? The boy says, let's play with the dog. And the girl says, okay. Entonces el boy le propone jugar también con el dog, ¿verdad? Let's play with the dog. Juguemos todos, no? You and the dog. Okay. And now the girl is, how is the girl now? The girl is happy or is still sad? Happy. happy. Oh, happy. now the girl happy. is happy. happy. Very good. Happy. The girl is happy now. Okay. Well, now. Here we have a value, students. Aquí tenemos un value, students, okay? What's this value about? Acerca de qué es este value? ¿Qué nos dice? ¿Qué nos menciona? Aha. Let me see. I'm going to show you something here. Yeah. That's it. The value says, ¿cuál es el value? ¿Qué nos dice el value? Be kind to animals. Okay, what is be kind to animals? ¿Qué cosa es be kind to animals? ¿Cuál es este valor? El be kind es ser amable, ser bueno con los animals. ¿Ustedes son kind con the animals? ¿Ustedes son buenos con los animals? ¿Ah, ¿No son buenos con los animals? Oh, I... Sí, sí, yes. yo soy bueno con mi perrita. Yes or no, mi yes perrito, or no. no. Okay, yes. Yes. yes, 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 right, yes. be kind to animals, you have to play with the animals, tienen que jugar con los animals, you have, you must give them some affection, tienen que darle cariño a los animals, right, hay que ser amables, hay que ser buenos con los animals, 
Yeah. Here we have this, uh, this value, be kind to animals. Now let's go to this part. Let's go to this part and you're gonna listen the story. Pay attention. Look, my ball is black and white. I can kick my ball. Wow. Look, it's a dog. It can jump. Hey, it's my ball. I like this dog. It's happy. I'm sad. I want my ball. Let's play with the dog. Okay. Well, this part was about uh, the dog, right? No, about the story. This was about the story, yeah? Now, students, we are going to stop here because, well, we have to go to the workbook part. Ahora vamos a ir a nuestro workbook, okay? Let's go to the workbook. Let's go to this page. Do you remember the previous class? We stopped on this part, right? Do you remember? Okay, very good, Xiomara. Who else is on this part? Very good, Ian Khaled. Very good, Carlos Matias. Very good, Xiomara. Are you on this part? Yes, are you here, right? You know, the previous class, we did this activity, right? La, la, la clase anterior, we did this activity. Hicimos la activity number one. Ahora nos corresponde hacer the activity number two. What do you have to do here? Here says something, no? Draw activity two, draw and count, then say. We have to draw. For example, what's this, the girl uh, saying? She said, I have 13. Okay, to get 13, we have to do something. For example, this is the sun. Let's draw the sun, okay? Here is one. I'm gonna draw another. Two and three. Okay, there are three suns here. I'm gonna do this. Okay. Okay, these are three suns. Now let's draw some happy faces. I'm gonna draw here. There, there is one, two, three, four, five happy faces. So let's draw here the happy faces. I'm gonna do something with the happy faces. This is one happy face, right? Two, three, four, and five okay now we have to write here this no uh -huh. how many suns do we have i'm gonna color the suns here the suns one two three no there are three suns i'm gonna write here the number three for the suns then we have the happy faces I'm gonna I'm gonna paint here the happy faces. I'm gonna change the color. 
One, two, three, four, five. Five happy faces. Right? Let's do this. Five happy faces. And now we have here some balloons. Okay? Now I'm going to draw here the balloons. Okay? Balloons. There is one balloon, two balloons, three balloons, four balloons, and five balloons. Okay? Let's do this with the balloons. I'm going to draw here the balloon. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do something. There it is. One, two, three. Oh, sorry. One, two, three, four, and five. Five balloons. I'm going to draw this. Yeah. One, two, three, four, and five. Five balloons. Okay, I'm going to write here now five. So we have here, we have here something. Yeah. Three and five, eight and five, 13. So it means that I have 13. Okay. What the girl said, right? You see what the girl said. I have 13. Yeah. This is something that we have to do now. So you work on this part, please. Work here. Okay, Xiomara, this is 72, right? Sorry, sorry. For me, 70. For you, this is 72. Thank you very much, Xiomara. Very good, Xiomara Perales. Excellent. Excellent. She finished. Xiomara, what says here, Xiomara? Peruanita. Oh, great. Oh, beautiful. To Peruanita. Excellent. I really like your sweater. I like your sweater. Great. Excellent. Now, Ian Colette, very good. Ian Colette, very good. Paula Valentina. Who else finished? Who else finish? One more minute, then we have to continue, okay, students? One more minute, one more minute.
Okay, very good, Luciana. Excellent. Well, students, I think we must continue. Okay, I'm going to erase all of this. I'm going to show you something here. Yeah, I'm going to show you something here. One moment, please. One moment. Okay, that's it. Yeah, let's work, let's work, yeah? Okay, students, let's continue. I'm gonna show you something here. El día de hoy, chicos, les voy a dejar su video homework, yeah? Y les, y les voy a explicar en qué va a consistir el nuevo video homework que van a realizar, ¿ya? Entonces, si por ahí está presente mamá, papá, o el hermano, la hermana, o la persona que, nos, que les acompaña siempre, bueno, a decirle que preste mucha atención, porque voy a explicar en qué va a consistir el nuevo video que van a tener que realizar, ¿ok? ¿Ya? El tema, el tema del video que ustedes van a realizar ahora, se llama Can and Numbers. ¿Ok? Este es el tema. ¿Cuándo va a ser la fecha límite para su presentación? Van a tener hasta el 12 de diciembre para poder desarrollarlo. O sea, tienen exactamente 10 días para poder hacer este video. ¿Ya? ¿Qué van a hacer? Van a elaborar un video hablando acerca de seis actividades que el alumno puede realizar. Asimismo, van a mencionar si les gusta o no les gusta realizar esa actividad, esa acción, ¿ya? También van a realizar otros seis ejemplos adicionales, ¿ya? Utilizando half y los números entre el 13 y el 20 para mencionar diferentes objetos que pueden tener en casa o mostrarlos en una imagen. Ahora, ¿cómo vamos a hacer esto? ¿En qué va a consistir? Ahora voy a pasar a explicarles. Ya estoy dejando aquí eh, mencionando que la explicación para aquellos alumnos que no están presentes en la clase de hoy, la explicación de este video eh, y, y los ejemplos van a estar en la clase número 37 de su plataforma virtual. Ya este video que estoy grabando y este archivo PDF va a estar en su plataforma. ¿Ok? A ver, ¿qué dice? ¿Cuáles son los criterios a calificar? El uso adecuado del vocabulario de numbers. ¿Dónde está el vocabulario de numbers? Eso aprendimos, ¿verdad? Aprendimos los numbers desde el number one hasta el number 20. Desde el 1 al 20, ¿verdad? One, two, three, four, five, hasta el 20. Entonces, vamos a poner en práctica. Vamos a usar el vocabulario de numbers. ¿Qué más? La gramática de can. ¿Cuál es la gramática de can? ¿Se acuerdan cuando hemos trabajado I can run para indicar lo que yo puedo hacer? ¿no? Yo puedo correr, yo puedo saltar, I can run, I can jump, etc. ¿Ya? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? Tengo que utilizar también la gramática de like y la gramática de have. ¿Ya? Entonces, ¿dónde está la gramática de... de de like, ¿dónde está la gramática, la gramática de half? Es algo que ya lo hicimos anteriormente, ¿verdad? Cuando yo quiero decir que algo me gusta, digo, I like, ¿no? Cuando yo quiero decir que yo tengo, digo, I have, ¿no? Como aquí, ¿ve? I have, yo tengo, ¿ya? I have two hands, yo tengo, ¿ok? I have, yo tengo. Y I like, cuando utilizaba el I like para indicar o cuando quería indicar que algo me gusta, pues, ¿no? Decía, I like, ¿no? Ok, now, I, I remember I did this, ¿no? I like, for example, aquí está. I like, para indicar que algo me gusta. Ya, entonces, vamos a la explicación nuevamente de su, eh, de su, de su videíto. ¿Qué más se va a calificar? Los materiales y también el uso de este formato. Recuerden, hay que saludar, hay que presentar el tema, hay que presentarnos, hay que mostrar nuestros ejemplos y al final hay que despedirnos, ¿ya? Entonces, miren aquí cómo empezamos. Si grabamos en la mañana, good morning. Si grabamos en la tarde, good afternoon. Si grabamos en la noche, good evening, teacher and friends. My name is, te presentas, ¿no? My video is about, ¿cuál es el tema? Can and numbers. Y empiezo, y empiezo, ¿no? 
Aquí estoy poniendo como ejemplo, I can jump, ¿verdad? Para indicar que yo puedo. Y así mismo que estoy usando también el like. ¿Y qué voy a decir? I like jump, ¿no? Yo puedo saltar, a mí me gusta saltar, ¿ok? Ahí está un ejemplo con can y con like. ¿Ya? Porque recuerda, te dice aquí, son seis actividades que puedes hacer, ¿verdad? En este caso, yo puedo saltar. I can jump, ¿no? Luego, I can climb. Yo puedo escalar. De pronto, yo puedo escalar, puedo trepar también, ¿verdad? Entonces, digo, I can climb, pero tal vez es algo que no me guste hacer mucho, ¿no? ¿Y qué diré? I don't like climb. No me gusta trepar, no me gusta escalar, ¿Ya? Entonces, de esa manera tú vas a completar tus seis ejemplos de las cosas o de las actividades, de las acciones que puedes realizar, ¿no? Porque, y finalmente nos indica si puedes o no puedes realizar esa, perdón, si te gusta o no te gusta esa actividad la cual nos mencionaste. ¿Qué más? A ver, también vas a tener... Esos son los seis primeros ejemplos, ¿verdad? Y los seis siguientes, porque aquí te dice, ¿no? Seis ejemplos utilizando half y los números. Ok, ¿cómo vas a hacer esos ejemplos utilizando half y los números? Por ejemplo, tú nos puedes mostrar una imagen donde hayan 13 colors, donde hayan 13 colores, ¿no? Nos muestras la imagen y dices, I have 13 colors. Tengo 13 colors, 13 colores. Y empiezas a contarlos. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, hasta llegar al number 13. ¿Ya? Teacher, en lugar de mostrar una imagen, puedo hacer con mis colors de verdad, porque yo tengo un montón de colors. Claro, puedes hacer. I have 13 colors. One, two, three. Four, five, etc. ¿Ya? Ok. Puedes hacerlo también con objetos reales. Recuerda que vas a poner en práctica los números de entre el 13 al 20, del 13 al 20. ¿Ya? Me vas a hacer ejemplos con esos números o con esas cantidades. ¿Ya? De igual manera vas a hacer siete, seis ejemplos. ¿Ok? Y luego al finalizar tu presentación vas a decir, that's all, thank you very much. Y como ya estamos eh, celebrando el espíritu navideño, vamos a decir Merry Christmas y Goodbye. ¿Ya? Eso es todo lo que van a tener que hacer. Recuerda que dice aquí que todos los videos se suben al grupo de Facebook de su salón. Y aquí estoy dejando el enlace del grupo de Facebook por si acaso. Recuerda, este material va a estar en tu plataforma y la fecha límite para que presentes este video en el grupo de Facebook es hasta el 12 de diciembre. ¿Ok? Well, students, I just want to say thank you very much. That's all for today and see you the next class. Bye-bye, students. Take care. Goodbye.